All right, guys, we're back at the salon, and I've been here for about two hours sanding, and it's been so much work. Good thing I've been doing my ab roller and my thigh master for at least two months. So, kind of fit. And there's some things I'd like to go over with the customers that are watching this video, maybe not just at my salon or any salon across the country. My reason for doing this is I don't feel like governments or um, elected leaders, they're great people. I don't want the job. I can barely run my salon, let alone a whole country. But for me, I like to affect my little square and improve on it. And I feel like I'm the best person in my neighborhood, in my own shop, that is ready to lead and take safety to the next level. And hopefully these tips serve not just me, but you. So for customers, what we're gonna do is when you pull up Let's say you have a two o'clock appointment. Get here at 150, 155, 158, you know what I mean? Text us, hey, is my station ready? Or, hey, yeah, come on in. We saw you pull up. Maybe we'll flash a, some Morse code in the window. We'll all have to learn how to do that again. Beep, 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 beep. So, that's one thing that we thought we would do. And that gives us time to clean the station, you know, prepare, you know, all the brushes and the combs and everything that we need to keep you and us healthy. And there's no reason why it can't be a win-win for everybody. One of the other things we're implementing is contactless payment. When you're here, we'll send you an email towards the, la the latter part of your service with the amount. If you want product, we'll ask you. We'll send you an invoice. And on that invoice, you can pay, you can tip, uh, leave a comment. We take all the comments moderately serious, depending on the source. Like if it's my mom saying, best haircut I ever had, Richard's a genius. I don't think she realizes that I can see that she sent that and it still makes me feel good. All right, who am I? I'll take a compliment anytime I can get one. So we will send you the email, you'll pay. Make sure you pay before you leave because I don't know if you know about my reputation. I will hunt a girl down. I will hunt a boy down. I'll chase you to your car and do you, all right, all right, take my wallet. We don't want to have to do that. We don't want, it's contactless. I can't tackle you on the way out because social distancing. So it takes the fun out of being in business, this whole COVID thing, because who doesn't like a good foot race in boots? I don't know anybody. There's gonna be a list of expectations on our website listing the things that are important to us from our customers and things that we're doing for you as well. So we're gonna work together on this. We're gonna come out of this healthy. Um, out of the ashes comes, you know, usually something great. And that's, that's how I live my life. I live positively, you know, you can't help but have a bad day. You can't help but have negative thoughts. But if you could just think that things will be okay and it could be worse. And you know, guys, if you're not having fun, what are you having? Okay? So let's have some fun. Let's stay healthy. Let's move forward. We're going to come out of this together looking good. All right, another day in the books. We are going to paint tomorrow. 
All right. Good night, y'all.